One of the six fishermen kidnapped for ransom on Monday has been released. We're told a portion of the $200,000 ransom demand was paid prior to the return of Jerry O'Brien. Around noon, the 36-year-old was brought to shore by Venezuelan fishermen, whom he said were his friends. This follows an appeal by relatives to the kidnappers to release their loved ones. In an off-camera interview today, relatives said the ransom demand of 200,000 U.S. dollars is unthinkable and they just don't know how they can raise the money. Everyone distraughted, just trying to cope with whatever happened. I'm praying for the best, hoping that they release them and send them back home because we do have that kind of money to pay. Just an average family, we can't come up with that kind of money. It's real hard. We don't have any kind of money to say put away or anything like that to come out with anything. The five men are still being kept hostage. They are Ricky Rambrose, Jason O'Brien, Brandon Arjun, Linton Manohar, all in their 30s, and 17-year-old Jude Jaikaran. They were snatched out at sea on Monday after leaving the Mon Diablo fishing facility. Meanwhile, Commissioner of Police Gary Griffith says the TTPS is working on the matter, but he cannot reveal the facts of the operation for obvious reasons. Monday, but there's a lot that we cannot bring forward to the media or even to the family of what it is we are doing. But we have been liaising with all the family members. We're not going to talk to the neighbor, friend, cousin. So people will continue to call the media and say, well, you know, I'm the family. I'm the sister, I'm the brother. So somebody might be a sister, but we are talking to the wife.